Yeah. Like, look at this guy. He got oh, yeah. cut off. We are the Predator. Tonight we're playing the Doll Hut. Um, free metal show. Free metal show. Um, just a bunch of bands. Um, you know, as far as me, like I love to play live, whether it's in front of two people or 500. Um, and we're just trying to get our name out there and get people to get a buzz going. I think we represent pretty much a lighter side of metal, like Deftones, this kind of sound. It's got I'll say melody. Orange County hardcore. Yeah, you but, know. You know, they're scared to say it. <laughs> Heavy with melody. Yeah. Heavy melody. with melody. Good metal. breakdowns, but mellow, yeah. good clean parts. Stuff you can get into Something on there. Like. Mm, yeah, like we like to play some mellow slow stuff, but I think of all, all of us are pretty much hardcore metalheads. So well, I like to get into the rap business. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're all pretty well rounded. Yeah, hip hop and but, jazz fusion. Yeah, yeah. Now we like it. Metal. I get down on the harmonicas. Some blues. We're uh, big like Meshuga, uh, Deftones, Devil sure. Driver, Definitely at the for me. a lot of Swedish metal, Black Dahlia of course, uh, Kill Switch, Hate Breed, I mean we could go on and on. Old I mean, school shit like Tupac. Pantera, Tupac. you know, we got, go all uh, the way back to Iron Maiden and Judas Priest and all exactly. old school stuff. If, all if, it's, if it's metal and it's good, it's we, we've heard it. Check out my music too on Reverb Nation right here. Yes, yeah, Reverb Nation, it's Facebook. Hit it all up. Breakdowns and things like that, like things that get your head bobbing, because the main thing is try to keep the energy up so the crowd can stay in. I listen to a lot of hardcore. Like Terror is a big influence in my in my life. Like I grew up like going to Corona Showcase Theater. Yeah, it was <laughs> sick. It was a I don't know a lot of hardcore music. Comeback Kid. Definitely. So. Thursday. Parkway Drive. Parkway Drive. Year. Yeah. Don't lie, he was a <laughs> Taking Back Sunday kid <laughs> <laughs> at the drive-in. <laughs> hey, I don't mind Taking Back Sunday. I don't either. <laughs> I grew to that. Third strike. Yep. Um, <laughs> in our heads. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we all have our hardships, all four of us. So like, we all just—it's all from our past experiences and just like shit we've overcome and like what we're like going through. I mean, pretty general to the most, like, people, like, I mean, our society today is like fucked. So, so I mean, it's it's based on society and like how it's like, trying to survive, you know, surviving and uh, being strong, I don't know. I think what's cool about us too is like, as far as our writing process, like, we all trust each other a lot. So like, there's not a lot of, you need to do this or you need to do that. Like, we, we just come in with what we have and, put it together and it just kind of works. Yeah, four guys that have nothing in common at all get together and for Besides some reason... Besides girls that like white pants. You know, <laughs> we, we get together and for some reason when we play music together it all works. But. Yeah.
we would never probably associate with each other at all. Like, look at this guy. I would never <laughs> fucking walk up to him on the street. Yeah. Ron, the big rock star's got like, look at this guy. He got oh, yeah. cut off. Excuse me, I'm in the middle of an interview. <laughs> look at this guy. He's a fucking <laughs> gangster. <Hey>. Come <laughs> see us play. Support yeah. your local musicians. Yes, please. Oh, yeah. Stop downloading free music. Yes. Well, I mean, you don't really want to promote yourself. I have the bandana. I mean, if you look a little bit close, no, it's like... <laughs> Bandana. This is coming out, you know, in the uh, coming out the end of 2012. Yes, see yes, it yes, all yes. Trademark Daniel Cobalt's on video. Yes, I guess you got to fire the merch guy then, right? Yes. Yes.